My name is Tutu Gilimbata. I'm the Regional Advocacy Lead at Arasa. Uh, part of the work that Arasa does is um, advocating for the promotion, protection and respect of bodily autonomy and integrity for everyone in Eastern Southern Africa. Part of that work identifies working with, uh, identifies key and strategic partners such as the media, members of parliament, as well as national human rights uh, institutions in, in 10 countries, both in Eastern Southern Africa. Uh, we identified the media as a key and strategic partner because of the role that they play um, in either influencing or um, uh, threatening human rights because we believe that if media personnel report in a manner that is person-centered and human rights-centered or from a human rights approach, then we have the power to eradicate the stigma and discrimination associated with sexual and reproductive health and rights, as well as minimizing uh, discrimination and prejudice against key populations in their diversity. We, are, we acknowledge that if we train media personnel on bodily autonomy and integrity and the important role that they can play in the promotion and protection of such rights, then they would have to report in a manner that puts the person first um, in their reporting outside of influencing how the public uh, responds to the content. For instance, if a media personnel is reporting on a girl that has died because they drank domestos or they used a coat hanger to try and terminate a pregnancy in a country where termination of pregnancy is illegal, a media personnel can report in a manner using their own stigma in a manner that would make the reader also judge and um, have prejudice and stigma against the girl who would have lost their life because the policy does not allow for them to have access to safe abortion. So we do believe that uh, the, the media is a very important tool and organ to changing public perspectives on sexual and reproductive health and rights and also the promotion and protection of such fundamental rights of everyone, regardless of their social status, regardless of their race, regardless of their economic status. So um, as Arasa and Athena and the She Learns program, the adolescent girls and young women in their diversity that are attending this workshop, we believe that everyone has a role in the promotion of human rights and believe that um, if we all work together, in the, the, if all the different stakeholders come together towards the advancement of sexual and reproductive health and rights, we will all have a better Africa for all. Thank you.